chips and queso, Sonny and Cher. We love a duo around here, don't we? <laughs> we sure do. And today we are talking about one of the most sophisticated pairings around. And one of my favorites, wine and cheese. Mm. Here to help us out is author of Brunch Gods, Garvey Alexander. Hi, Garvey. Hi. Hi. How are you? Wine and cheese do feel like they were sort of made for each other. Perfect combination honestly the perfect marriage i'm a new judge with the tasting alliance we run the most prestigious awards in the booze industry wow the san francisco spirit awards and this one best in class Ooh. this one right here yes so here. this is the lubanazi chenin blanc oh i like a chenin blanc i, think. I don't even know what that is what is it it's like kind of chardonnay like chenin, this this actually captures the essence of cape town in every sip mm. this is a south african chenin blanc so the mm, varietal like nice. is from south africa nice we we have it paired with prosciutto, dried apricots, some nuts. Mm -hmm. It's simply delicious. Another white wine you have, you like? Yes, I love this Wander and Ivy. It's a single serving Look of at the single wine. Serving. I know, that's cute. It's so cute. The vessel's amazing. Adorable. I mean, forget the flask. You can just pop, pop this into your bag <laughs> instead. It's a good, like, per yeah. picnic situation. It right? is, it is. It's perfect for, it's perfect all year round, honestly. Yeah. Um, and I love this because of how elegant the uh, mm -hmm. vessel looks. Not mm -hmm. only that, the Sauvignon Blanc has notes of guava, it's has good. notes of apple. Mm -hmm. It's real subtle. I can see this on an airplane. You have the most yeah. soothing voice in the entire world. <laughs> Thank you so much. Did you always have I that mean, low wait, of a me, voice? Me soothing yes. after Usher? I mean, I appreciate I mean, that. come on, come on. <laughs> I appreciate on. it. It's, you have got it. It's what I do. I love that. This okay. is tenfold. So I call this Pierce Brosnan and Sean Connery. I feel like 007 every time I take a sip of eye. Because it's luxurious? It's uh, so elegant. It's so sophisticated. Right here we have the Bin 704. This is going to be our Cabernet. Okay. You're going to get dried tobacco notes, sage, allspice, mm, raw good. nutmeg. Oh, I love that. I know. I, I mean, I'm going to have to take one of these glasses. This is a great <laughs> winter, oh, winter wine. You can have delicious. this one. Do you chill that or do you just drink it room temp? I just drink mine room temperature, uh -huh. although it'll be great with the cube if you like it a little I lighter. I like it chilled red. Uh -huh. So I had to double up on penfolds. I'm doing the Bin 600, which is going to be 32% Syrah and 68% Cabernet and with oh, this that's is a good combo it yeah. is and you see you can see that it's more of a crimson color yeah it's more of a red cherry flavor there's a bit of mocha a bit of dark chocolate note to it as well to the mm. finish it's just mm. as, mm. as good these it's are like good. that's delicious yeah these I feel like feel a secret like, agent every uh, time both of these feel like good Thanksgiving wines mm -hmm. right honestly all of these will be great for your holiday season but they're great options year-round as well. Mm -hmm. Great options year-round as well. Okay. So I'm sipping on Liars right now. It's a non-alcoholic sparkling. Um, you don't have to feel guilty missing out on a champagne yeah. toast anymore. That's kind of nice. We have mm -hmm. an amazing selection. This is also award-winning as well as the Lubanazi in the front. So mm. this you get mm. the classic notes of green apple. I like that. Richness of pear, mm -hmm. but it still has that spark and bubble. Does it come in single serving too or is that and something else? And it comes else? in a single serving. I as love well. these are cute. Those are cute little yeah. Pack. yeah, these um, are for you guys to take home and enjoy. Oh my Garvey, gosh, thank, thank you, so, so much. Of for course. Happy you came. And I'm your voice is really soothing. Isn't it? Uh -huh. I mean, I'm mesmerized. <laughs> Me too.